Hello and welcome to Connie's Crazy World. So I have a video for you from when I went to the local fish market and picked up some grouper and red snapper and we cooked it at the resort. And I realized I didn't do an intro, so I got to do an intro. Hi! So let's go ahead and show you what we did. All right, so it's time to start getting ready for dinner. And I've got fish today from the local fish market. Um, so I've put salt and pepper on this one. I've put pepper and seasoning salt here. I'm gonna go ahead and put a couple things of lemon on them. Along with some onions. I think I have some peppers in there too. I'll probably put some peppers in. So let's go ahead and put some onions on this one. Spread them all out. When my dad cooked salmon, this is how he loved to cook it. So it's just natural to go ahead and do this. Put some more here. More, I mean, I got some more lemons here. So let's just go ahead and put some more lemons on top. All right, let me see if I got any more peppers left. All right, so we are out of peppers. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do up these foil packets. One foil packet done. Those two are done. And now I have grouper cheeks left. And I marinated these. I put in some, um, I had some Krabby Bill seasoning left and I've marinated in them. And so I think these are ready just to go in some foil. And then they'll be ready to go out in the grill. Um, probably add a little more salt and pepper. And then I have a spaghetti squash that I'm probably just going to put on the grill hole like this and then cut it apart. Um, so yeah, this is going to be fun. Let me go ahead and get the foil for this guy. Now these grouper cheeks might just become fish tacos later this week. Oh no! Don't have a lot left. So I guess I'll just put these in the oven then, maybe. Those are ready to go. With the rest of my grouper cheeks, I guess I'll just throw them in my pan. little guys out. They won't need very much time to cook. I think I'll put just a little bit of seasoning salt on them. A little bit of pepper. And get this going to 350. It's raining outside right now, so I'm not sure if we're gonna cook everything on the grill or if it's all going in, the, in there. So we'll wait and see. 
All right, so it is just a pouring, so I guess we're doing everything inside. So I'm gonna go ahead and put a dab of butter in both of the spaghetti squash. And some pepper and get these guys in the oven even while it's heating up because they will take the longest of everything here. Got my grouper cheeks, the ones in the pit foil and the ones that are just gonna be in the pan. Um, I got my red snapper and the foils with the lemon and the onions. I probably should have put butter in with them, but we'll see how it is in a little bit. When we were at Parksdale yesterday, picked up some of the shortcake and I got a whole bunch of strawberries here. So, Victoria doesn't like fish, so she already ate dinner. So I'm betting if I brought her some strawberry shortcake, What I need is a little ice creamer. Whipped topping, but doesn't that look delicious? Also have some leftover corn on the cob and zucchini from last night. And I'm gonna make a bag of quinoa and brown rice. Well, the snapper is falling apart. It's cooked so well. Here's the rest of the juke grouper cheeks and the biscotti spaghetti spaghetti squash is ready to eat and here we are the final project we got our corn left over our zucchini our fish our rice and our glass what of wine do you do and dessert? our strawberry shortcake look i found some ice cream so, so thanks, thanks for, for watching joining us Connie's for dinner tonight. Crazy World. And don't forget to like, subscribe. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and all that, and all jazz. that jazz. See you later. Bye.